Cool. I um I got well it, on that topic. I finally got the answer I've been looking for, John, and and that was it came from many of you. Uh, I'll read Jeff's email, but uh, but it came from I think Scott and and Steve as well, and maybe even Sean. There were there were many S's involved, but uh, but I will read Jeff's email, who says, uh, in Mac in Mac Geek Gab eight eighty two and prior, you discussed difficulties in printing web pages from Safari. I have found that in macOS Big Sur, I am able to get excellent renderings of dynamic or static web pages by selecting export to PDF from Safari's file menu and simply saving the file to my drive. The export will include the entire length of the active web page, not just the part that's visible on the screen. And it's totally right. Uh, it makes it not really conducive to printing, of course, because you probably don't have a printer that prints to paper that's that long. But uh, or it'll be very narrow uh, if it if it shrinks it down to fit on one page. But yes, this is exactly what I was looking for is the, a way to get a PDF of a single web page. And it was right there in Safari's file menu the whole time. So thank you, Jeff. I appreciate it. And thank you, everybody who sent that in. That's uh, it's nice to nice to put a cap on that one, John.